Man, this place is a mess. So many body parts everywhere. I'd be pressed to find someone that's more or less in one piece, let alone an actually living person. Shit. I kinda hope this wasn't another waste of time, but... Oh, damn, never mind. Spoke too soon. You good down there, Chum? Actually, don't answer that. You look like you might have a hole in your lung. Hey, hey, calm down. Stop moving so much. You can get up and go whatever the hell after. I'll make sure you won't fall apart. Alright? Let me just... Hmm. This. It's my med scanner. Now, take a deep breath. Tingles, huh? Okay, good news. You don't have any holes in your lungs. Or any other vital organs for that matter. So you can talk now. Bad news is, your left leg isn't registering, meaning it's basically as good as gone. Got any crew in there you wanna keep? Or should I just leave it here for the meat wagon guys? No, I'm not with Truma team. And I'm definitely not with meat wagons, so you can keep your eddies in your pocket, Chum. I'm just a bored mad tech trying to hone my skills. I don't think Trum are even gonna come to a place like this. No offense, but you guys don't look like the types to have coverage. Alright, alright, shut it. If you want me to haul you to a hospital, I can. Then you can pay out your ass for a bed, treatment or whatever. But in the state you're in? And you'd have a better chance getting an all-expenses-paid vacation to the moon than surviving the trip. And you're one of the lucky ones. Look around, Chumba. I spent like 15 minutes looking for a single person that hadn't been shredded to pieces. A couple bullet holes and an eviscerated leg is lucky. So let me ask properly this time. Do you want to bleed out halfway to the hospital? Or do you want some free medical treatment from a barely qualified stranger? And that's what I thought. Hold still. I'm gonna hit you with a stem. It's gonna make sure you don't flatline immediately and ensure the next steps aren't complete agony. <laughs> Better? Good. So, why the field of bodies anyway? Gang war or something? Shit, no way! A cyber psycho! Man, that's rough. Hey, uh. It fucked off before I got here, yeah? No way in hell I'm sticking around otherwise. Alright, alright, got it. Heck! Maybe if they hit some other gang of unfortunates, I can dump you with Truma team then. Oh, hmm. Maybe close your eyes for a sec. Well, if you really want to watch me sue your leg off, then be my guest. Fuck yeah, I'm cutting your leg off. Shit's absolutely wrecked. You will leave it like that any longer and it will rot off anyway. You can get an actual doctor to stick a new one on. Growing limbs is cheap as hell. Heck, maybe even get them to give you some cyberware instead. Here, bite on this so you don't chip a tooth or nothing. Now, take a deep breath. I'm gonna get sewing. This won't take long. Mm. Oh fuck, Chum, you can scream, but at least don't do it right in my ear. Yeah, yeah, it hurts. My cheap ass stims aren't magic, you know? Ah, there. One freshly cut leg to add to the pile of severed limbs. It's not over yet, though. Need to cauterize the wound, or else you'll just bleed out. I could lie, but I won't. This will be about ten times worse. Okay. Three, two, one.
Oh, hey. You good? You kind of passed out when I catered your stump. Yeah, you're at my place. They don't know when you'd wake up, and I didn't really want a hospital sticking the bill on me since you're out of it. I don't have a car, so I got more than a few looks trying to haul your unconscious ass all the way in here. I got your bullet holes wrapped up, cauterized your wounds, jabbed a speed heal and an antibiotic into ya. You should be good by tomorrow. If you wanna hop down to the hospital, and be my guest. But you're free to stay on my couch if you'd rather just rest up. It's just another blood stain on the cushions, no big deal. Yeah. I've got a few booster friends who crash here sometimes if they need me to fix them up. Kinda sucks, but they pay sometimes, so I'm not that broken up about it. Looking for your gun, huh? Yeah, sorry about no. As generous as I was bringing you here, I'm not about to let some rando off the street bringing a gun into my house. You can have it back when you leave. You know... I thought you were a booster or some other kind of gang, but that gun was a piece of junk. And after inspecting you, I didn't find much chrome, especially not anything geared for fighting. What do you do in Night City then, Jumbata? Hey, we're a nomad family. Shit, that must have been your crew then, huh? My condolences. You still got anyone you can get back to? Huh. Well, if you need somewhere to stay, my place is always open. And got some pre in the fridge if you're hungry. Just, uh, don't eat all of it. I'm a little low on money, and I've still got a few days until payday. Yeah, I, uh, work for a small clinic down in the streets. I've been wanting to get a position like a paramedic, but I needed some more experience out on the field first, which is why I was looking for people to fix up. Glad I went. Meant I could see you at least one person. Shit. I've got work in like half an hour. When I'm gone, get something to eat and then get some sleep. It's the only thing that will stop feeling you like shit. Oh, and if you're thinking of stealing anything, the only valuable stuff I have is my mat tag gear, which I'm taking with me. Oh, and the food. I'd be kind of pissed if you took that. Alright, later, Tomb.